Wow, wow, wow. Isn't it a beautiful shot? Hi guys, this is Jawad Sumro. And in this tutorial, I will teach you how to animate the photos in 3D. First, create a new composition. Let's name this composition as Picture Animation. Make sure the width is 1920 pixels and the height is 1080 pixels. Click OK. Import the forest picture into this layer. Resize the image to fit the screen. Enable the 3D object of the image layer. Let's import the picture of the lady into the composition. Enable the 3D object of this layer as well. Let's decrease the workspace up to 30 seconds. Select the camera object on the bar at the top. Go to layer, new and click camera. Select the preset as 28mm. Now we can rotate the images in 3 dimensions. Go to ladies pictures layer and adjust the anchor point up to 190 points. Let's change the direction of the images to fit the screen. Click the camera layer, open the camera options, enable the stopwatch and increase the pixels as long as you want. Bring the pointer towards the end of the clip and insert the keyframe by decreasing the pixels. Let's move the pointer to see the results. Click the girls layer and enable the scale stopwatch of the layer. Adjust the scale as long as the picture edges lie under the screen. Let's play the timeline. The effect is very slow. To overcome this, highlight the keyframes and drag it backwards to speed up the effect. The effect looks perfect. Let's decrease the work area to 14 seconds. Now select the puppet tool on the top bar. Let's make the puppet point on her face and body. Go to effects, mask 1, deform and select puppet 1. Move the pointer towards the end. Make sure that you select the puppet tool and change the position of the puppet. Now we can realize that our head moves as we move the puppet point. Let's play the timeline. We can see that she is moving her head as the camera zooms out. Let's import the pale yellow leaves into the project. Let's resize the image and enable the 3D object. The leaf is behind the girl because the girl is positioned near to camera in 3D environment. Let's decrease the opacity a bit. Select the leaves layer and press Ctrl and D to duplicate the layer. Now I will be decorating the image with yellow leaves.
output is totally cool as only two leaves are flying. Let's input more leaves into the image. Let's scale it up. This looks very gentle and perfect. Let's import the leaves and place them at random positions. Let's scale up the image of the forest, enable the stopwatch, bring the pointer towards the beginning, increase the scale up to 254 points, let's add the blur effect, go to effects, blur and sharpen and select fast blur, enable the stopwatch and increase the blurriness up to 5 points, move the pointer towards the end, reduce the blurriness to 0, and that's it. Let's render the video, go to file, export, click add to render queue, click lossless, choose the format as quicktime and click ok. Go to format options, make sure that the video codec is H.264 and click ok and ok. I hope this tutorial was helpful for you, thanks for watching.